Hey guys, check out this old beauty, made in 1986 by JRL, and uh, this is a uh, it's a first generation uh, Mustang fastback, and I believe it's about one twelfth scale, and I do not have the remote for it. Uh, the footage you saw at the beginning, I just turned on the RC car, and it was just accelerating. And then for the donut, I just turned the wheels and just let it do its own thing. So I don't know how I'm going to figure out what's wrong with it. It must be the servo. I don't know what's going on. I don't really, um, you know, fix RC cars. I just like to uh, film them and uh, drive them. So let's go look at the, uh, the measurements of this uh, supposedly 112 scale car. From the very back to the front, it's it's almost 15 inches, roughly. And then the wheelbase, it's uh, looks like it's eight and three quarters inches long for the wheelbase. And then now the width. Let's go look at this width. It's about. Let's do it from the longest. It's almost uh, five and a half inches. Uh, wide so uh yeah this is a very uh a very nice looking uh body i don't like that uh on the hood though but it's it's pretty nice looking uh the wheels are gorgeous you've got a fatter set of wheels in the back as you can see um very uh high quality detail and it's rubberized uh, tires and it's got some weight in it i do have the battery inside and I do want to show you what happens when I turn the uh, the power on. Now, look at that, that acceleration on this RC. That is power. Very powerful. And uh, you saw what happened when I turned it on earlier. That thing was a beast. And I don't know for sure, but the steering seems to be a digital proportional so when I turn it, it's hard to tell without the remote, but it feels like it's a digital proportional steering. Don't know about the speed, but man, this thing accelerates real fast. I wish I had a remote and I wish this thing was working properly because this thing should not be uh, accelerating once I turn it on. Uh, that's, that's, a, that's a shame because I do want the chassis. But these wheels are perfect for what I want with this uh, RC car. So here's the bottom of the uh, the chassis. You can see it's JRL 1986, made in Taiwan. And the radio frequency is, uh, well, it's got band 3, 27.095 megahertz. There's a little mark there. I did not do that. Man, it's, it's nice. Um, it, it's a pretty, it's a pretty decent size. But if I can't get the chassis working, then I'm going to have to get a whole new chassis.